7 tips to get inspired when you're lacking inspiration. Whether you want to start a new track or finish your existing project, you've probably already struggled with getting new ideas. You're definitely not alone. Tip number one, use the Mimo app on your phone to record your melody ideas when you get them. Bless you, Mozart. Pretty often it happens to me, I wake up in the morning and I dreamt of this crazy cool melody and 10 minutes later I have completely forgotten the melody. A lot of times inspiration hits when you are not in the studio. My name is Mike Williams and we're back in the kitchen. Recording your own voice on your phone can be a great tip. When you're in the studio you can listen to your little cringe memos. You can make a banger like that. Nobody will know it all started from a cringe vocal. At least I hope. <laughs> Tip number two, produce consistently. It's pretty hard to come back to music production after a long break. If you stop making music for two whole months, it can be hard to even know which knob to turn. Yes. Try to set yourself some easy to achieve goals, the smart goals. You smart. For example, I'm going to produce at least once a week. The goal will be consistency. Just show up. Show up in the studio, be in the mindset of producing something. Do it! For example, you can make a melody, make a new chord progression. If you're not in the mood, at least you showed up. Spend five minutes or five hours. I don't care. A first studio god doesn't care. Other goals can include taking part to a competition or simply release your own track on Spotify. Even if you are not 100% satisfied with it, at least release it. The goal is to post it on Spotify. Send me the link on Twitter if you want. And by the way, if you're wondering which service I'm using to publish my music everywhere, I'm using DistroKid which is great, you pay a fixed amount per year and you can post as many tracks as you want. So no excuse not to post this year. And if you use my link, you can get 7% off your DistroKid subscription, which is great. Tip number three, don't produce. Yes, listen to music you like. Watch a festival live stream. You'll see the crowd reaction. It can really set you in the mood of producing. Listen to your favorite artist. I guarantee you will get new ideas from that. Tip number four, produce with someone. If you have a cat juicer like me, you can produce with the cat juicer. Do you want to produce today? No. Yes, you it's so much different than producing alone. Drop the cat on the keyboard and you will get for sure new ideas. If you are lacking some ideas in a specific domain like the melodies, drums, chords, genre, chances are that your producer friend will have ideas in that field. Two brains are smarter than one, so be smart. If you don't have a real world friend, you can find them on the internet in the comment section or you can join my official Discord server where you can meet many cool producers, maybe have a remote studio session. Tip number five. This one is quite weird and I've never heard it anywhere else. <laughs> but I do it sometimes. I compare it with looking at the sky, looking at the clouds in the sky. When you look at the clouds, chances are you will identify patterns there. Maybe see a face or a horse. Your brain will work very hard to identify shapes there. Turn the TV on in a different room. Turn the volume up. Let some commercials play. Close your door. Listen to the sounds through the door. Everything will sound pretty dull since it comes from another room. And this will force your brain to identify notes and melodies and chords from the commercials. And you will be like, hey, sounds like a melody. Like, <laughs> these dull sounds will stimulate your imagination. I don't know the exact scientific term behind that, but it works. Tip number six, download the MIDI file, load it up in your FL Studio, modify the notes and boom, you have something to start with. You don't start with a blank canvas. Tip number seven, that's the tip I got from Armin van Buren back in the days. He said, just play PS4. Do something else. Stop watching your screen. Stop praying to FL Studio God. Go for a walk. Go DJ at a party. Watch a movie. Change your environment. It's going to be much easier for you to get new ideas if you go do something else. What is your favorite way to get inspired? Let me know in the comments down below. If you want more tips about music production, go watch this playlist. See you soon, producers and cat producers, of course.